Hey there, Ventex here, and welcome to Trenches, a World War I horror survival game. Let's go ahead and start a new game. We'll keep jump scares, that's fine. Trenches of 1917. I used to love hearing those sounds. My wife's beautiful humming, my children calling me daddy, and the sweet music playing on our phonograph. But hearing those sounds now stirs up altogether new feelings, while I am only surrounded by tragedy and dead bodies. So there's a photo. Bunch of gentlemen in the trenches. A soldier doesn't fight because he hates what's in front of him. He fights because he loves what's behind him. Somewhere in the trenches, 1917. Alright. So here we are. We're sprinting across. So we can hide in little areas like this. Okay. There's a rat somewhere. We got a bottle. It says here, how to survive if left alone or injured in battle. One, crouch and stay low so enemies won't hear you. Two, hide under bunk beds or narrow spaces and stay safe. Three, don't run or you will make noise. Run only when necessary. Four, be careful when walking on wooden surfaces since it makes loud noise. Five, you can cause a distraction by throwing objects items, such as bottles. Objects items. Uh, six, mind your stamina. If you get tired, then you cannot outrun enemies. Seven, use your trench whistle if you're lost and follow the sound. But be careful because enemies can hear the whistle too. Be careful of your surroundings. Try to escape to a safe allies location and do not lead any enemies. Let's go. Let's do it. I'm ready. I think right now we're okay to run across. Haven't heard or seen anything creepy. I don't really know where to go. I'm just kind of walking. Hopefully we run into something soon. There's a creepy doll. Chilling here. Okay, there's a barrel. A few more barrels. Okay, this is some shells. Oh my gosh, what the heck happened here? Air evacuation nurse. And then this is a key. A key which can be used to unlock some door. Okay, that's disgusting. It's breathing behind you. There, a shoe just fell. Oh my gosh. It disappeared. Let's find that door, shall we? We went that way. Let's go this way. By the barrels. Uh-oh. Now is when stuff probably starts getting intense. There's a doll again. Did I face it that way? I thought I was facing another way. Where's that door? Over here? No, what's over here? Okay, just some sandbags. There's gotta be a door around here somewhere. Okay, maybe we head back. So there is a little bit of stamina. It takes a while though. Before it actually wears out. Okay, this is where we started. Was there a door back here that we didn't see? Ah. Welcome. Oh, it looks like you have a welcome mat down in the trenches. That's nice. I had a wonderful dream where I woke up next to my wife's beautiful humming and singing and my ch beautiful children calling me daddy. Then, all of a sudden, reality hit me and I woke up to a loud gunshot noise from a Mosin Nagant or someone from our squad that just got shot. We barely survived, but we made it. Today, we received our marching orders where we'll be going in the trenches to prepare for an attack. I'm scared. I feel hopeless. My soul feels black. The only thing that keeps me going is knowing that if I ever survive this, then I'll be able to see and hug my family all over again. 
That's the only thing that keeps me going. I will do my best to get home to my family. I hope this letter don't get to you because if it does, then it means I am dead. Tell my kids that daddy loves them. There's a few spelling mistakes I'll point out. Uh, I hope this letter don't get to you. Does it get to you? But it's World War One. Maybe uh, maybe they weren't as up on their English. My name is Junior Tommy Ellen. I'm a member of the 3rd U Troop Platoon that, under the orders of our platoon commander, we were sent out to clear out the trenches. We've been called out on air alarms raids that last few days and holding up here. We lost four of our men from our squad and many more from our platoon. We dragged the wounded men here, but they did not make it. We wrapped them up in sheets with the little we got, and we buried them once we start to dig up. The radio and our limited amount of ammo is the only dope we got. I think it means hope. A couple things there, so I think it'd be better if said, I'm a member of the 3rd U Troop Platoon, period. Under the orders of our platoon commander, comma, we were sent out to clear the trenches, or we were sent to clear out the trenches, but you don't need to send out, clear out. And then uh, they're at the end, obviously. <laughs> uh, the radio in our limited amount of ammo is the only dope we got. Bastards are what they are with their savage killings, sneaking up at night in such wrong methods of a clean fight. We thought this was bad until we saw a couple of them eating a corpse of what I assume is a woman caught up or taken in the trenches. What I saw I will never forget and will hunt me, hunt me, and will haunt me. Okay, missing an A. So the day I die, this is why I'm writing this letter to be cautious to spare a bullet in your pocket so if you are ever caught, then shoot yourself in the head instead. If anyone from our platoon reads this, you have to get out from the trenches as the enemy knows we are here. Hide from the enemy, get out. I hope to pull through all safe by the help of God. If there is one, keep moving forward. There's a lot of spelling errors in this game so far. That's what I'm seeing. War of Art. Open the door. Oh, the doll's still here. What is that? There's a lot of noise just then. Okay, we used a key. What's happening? Okay, there's a baby. It says here, strange looking fetus doll that cries and only stops when I pick it up. Maybe I need to follow the cries? So I have to get nine of them. I got one out of nine. Okay. Let's keep moving, I guess. I think I hear... No, that's a chair. Let's say, I think I hear another one. Okay. I do hear another baby. It's close. There it is. Uh oh. Oh, someone peeked at me. Judas. Okay, now we have to... Now we have to be a little bit more stealthy. Got a lot of notes here. A lot of pictures. Execution for desertion. Oh, that's a dead end. Oh, hello! Okay. We gotta find more of these babies. I wonder what the game is like without jump scares. Seems like there's a lot. Okay, we gotta find these babies without triggering this thing that's hunting us. So here's some wood, so we're going to crawl on the wood. Judas. Let's go this way. 
We should be able to walk here. I think only running on the dirt attracts attention, but walking should be fine. Keep going. Okay, we got some planes overhead. Some antlers there. Let's crouch. I hear a lot of footsteps around. I also hear a baby. What is that sound supposed to be? There's a way to hide. Go towards the baby cries. We gotta get nine of them. There's a little animal. That was loud. So close. I don't think it's over here to the left, no? Uh-oh. Ah, here. It's super close. How do I get over there? Maybe if I walk back across here? Whatever's chasing me sounds like it's close too. Might hide real quick. Oh, it's like right here. It stopped. I still think it's nearby. Speaking to me. Come on, go away. Yeah, I think we're all right. Walk across here. Oh, someone just went across there. Yes, this is the way. Here that we're getting close. Dang it, where is it? Ah, there it is. Okay. Body fell down. Interesting. Now what? We need more babies. I know you can't see me. Okay. Okay, that's cool. All right. Oh, hello. <laughs> Peekaboo. A statue moved. Yeah, we gotta find some more babies. Oh, hello, ma'am. All right. Oh, we got to crouch on this wood. Or else we'll be discovered. It sounds close. We blew out the candles. Happy birthday. Okay, let's keep going. If we find a place to hide, we'll blow our whistle and then hide. But I don't want to blow it and then get discovered. All right, let's go ahead and crouch. Oh no! It's here! It's behind me!
How do I get weight? How do I get away? It's gonna get me. I have nowhere, I can't run away fast enough. Yeah, it's got me. I can't run away fast enough. There's no way. My guy runs out of stamina. Once it finds you, it doesn't seem like it can lose you easily. James R. Johnson was found deceased in the battle of the trenches in 1917 after being found with several wounds. It said that he kept on fighting till his last breath, thinking about his family until he gave up. He'll be deeply missed by his wife, six-year-old daughter, and five-month-old son that will grow up without their father. Okay, let's try that again. Judas. Why does it say Judas and has an arrow pointing? Not real. What's not real? Ah, oh, there's a letter here. Enemies found espionage ready to be hanged. It's hard to see. I feel like the graphics just kind of got all dumb. What's going on? Why is it on low? No wonder. It was on Ultra before and it just reset itself to low for whatever reason. Not real. Okay. We gotta find these babies. Oh, I can see that's outlined when I do it. All right, let me wait to pick it up so I can blow another whistle. It's on cooldown right now. And come on. Sounds so close. Oh, we dead. That was quick. Kind of just spawned right next to me. All right, hopefully that distracted it. Oh, basketball. Oh, hello. I like how they peek out at you. I wish uh, the ghost in Phasmophobia did that. Oh, what is that thing? I don't see it. We just walking. Hello. That's a lady crying. Oh, it's just a doll. Okay. Anything over here? What's that about? Sounds like it's super close. Do it. Do what? What do you mean? I understand. Explain yourself. We're getting close to the other doll I found. Oh, there's a lady. Okay. I think we could sprint off the wood. 
Hello. Oh. <laughs> There's one. They keep peeking at me. Okay, we're close. Right on the other side. We're almost there. Okay, there's a body. Now what? Gunfire. A little jump scare. Yep. Okay. What does that sound? We need to find some more dolls. There's a moaning sound over here. We got some planes overhead. Nothing in the bucket. What else can we find? Another dead end? There's a lot of those. Another bucket. I think it's close. Where do we go? Is this? Oh, there's a baby running from it. My vision is getting a little blurry. Oh, just peekaboo. They keep peeking at me. Judas. There's a way to hide. Okay, I don't see nothing. As far as dolls, there's a little note here. People hanging or deserting. It's like right next to me. I got nowhere to go. Sneak around. So close. Okay. Why does it say Judas? Like a fake wall or something? Can't go that way. Like a maze. Can't find anything. Another dead end. Try this way. So far, nothing. Okay, a little flash or peekaboo. Try going down here.
Just walking for now. They like to peek at me. Not like a cannon. Go down this way. I hear a baby. We're getting close. There it is. Nice. Place is huge. These are some impressive trenches. The chair. Ah, uh, nothing there. Okay, you can take it. I was it using the chair. Okay. We gotta find these dolls. Long trenches. Front line trench. Looks like it's coming to an end up here. Okay, let's take a left. I wonder, I guess other than the peekaboo guy, we won't have any more jump scares if we went to the same place that we've already been to. I do not see any dolls. Hello. He's super close. Let's go this way. All right. Where could it be? I hear music. This thing's like right next to me. Oh no! Hide! It's right there. I wonder if it saw me hide. Just standing there. Okay, it looks like it's walking away. That's good. Let's just keep going. I have no idea where to go. I don't have a map or anything. Kind of walking. Hoping to find a baby eventually. Okay. There's an arm. Anything else? Hello. I really enjoy the peeking mechanic the most. What is that noise? Oh, I need to cut the wire. I need a wire cutter. Let's head this way. Maybe we'll find one over here somewhere. A 
Hello? Oh, there's an arm. Help, please. Thing is super close. Looks like you're missing your ring finger. Is it gone? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I got nowhere to go. Okay, I think we're okay. <laughs> Alright. I guess that's that hand. It's gonna be another dead end. A few boxes fell. There's a hideaway right there. Not sure where to go now. Seems like it's right behind us. Oh, we got a gun. A rusty lugger pistol. It is a German toggle locked recoiled operated pistol that holds seven rounds. Use. Elizabeth. I hope this letter gets to you. I'll give my life to see you and Sarah for a few seconds once again. I feel things coming to an end, but don't be sad. Please, as I don't feel empty anymore. I kind of feel happy. Happy that things are finally coming to an end. Happy that I don't have to look in the eyes of another brother while he takes his last breath. Happy that I know you'll be a wonderful mother to our daughter. I just want to let you know that just because I have passed away does not mean I am not with you. I'll always be there looking over you, keeping you safe. Whenever you feel lonely, just close your eyes and I'll be right by your side. I really did love you with all I had, you and Sarah both. Please know that my last thoughts were of you, the one that made a man of me. Elizabeth, do not mourn me dead, think that I am gone and wait for me, for we shall meet again. My time is coming to an end. I keep hearing things and seeing things, and this wound inside me is not making things easier. I do not need to tell you, as I know you can and will take care of our little one. Fetch her up as like yourself, and she will not have any enemies in the world. Tell her I love her, and to say her prayers and do well at school. I will always be proud of you. Take care, and I love you both. Farewell. The, the grammar and the punctuation really throws me off on this game. <laughs> as a writer, as someone who likes to write in my spare time, it's, it's rough. <laughs> Alright, let's go. It mimics your loved one's voices. Yes, I know that. Okay, so we have a gun. I'm assuming we can shoot this thing. I don't know what else a gun would be for. Where are the dolls at? I'm just gonna run. I guess. There it is. It just ran over there. I'm gonna try to shoot it next time I see it. Hiding place right there. Oh, crap. <laughs> My finger was on the trigger. Nothing.
I have no idea where to go. Stop screaming at me, Jesus Christ. There's a hiding place. Where are the wire cutters? That's all I really need, I think, to progress. See the guy running across there. I think I hear music. Okay. Nothing. I don't see anything. More barrels. A long hallway. Need more wire cutters. <laughs> Lots of shoes. Look at this guy. That's weird. My son George, I miss you so much. The war has separated us, but you're always in my heart. Sometimes I think about running away to come and see you again, but I know that I could be killed for desertion if I do. Maybe it's worth it. Let's head this way. Is that Predator? I know it's close. Crying baby. Oh, it's over there. You're right behind me. But I'm standing right beside you. Oh, you're beside me? <laughs> okay. We got five babies. No jump scare. I'm trying to find these babies. I'm gonna jump down. I hear some crying over here. Close. Like right on the other side of this wall. Hello. Yep, 
Be super close. All right, picked up another one. I hear like a demonic crying. Where are you? There it is. I hear another one. Hello. Okay. Off to the left. There's so many noises going on. What are you doing to mommy? It's super close. Sounds like it's right over here. There it is. Another one. It's right here. It's on the other side of this wall. Okay, we got nine dolls. Find a ladder and escape the trenches. Okay, we did it. We got all the dolls. Now we gotta just escape. Is this a ladder? No. Hide. I imagine a ladder would be on the outskirts. Find a ladder and escape the trenches. Hello? Ladder! We did it! Hey, there we are! My daughter looks... <laughs> look at those eyebrows. <laughs> that looks a little strange. Thank you for playing! Awesome! Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that game. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Check out the Twitter and Discord down description. I'll see you guys next time.